Okay, hi you guys. This is Jen. I'm back again. Ah, back like a what do they say? A bad penny or something? I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, I'm not feeling a hundred percent today, so you have to excuse my humor and and pretend that it's really funny. This is Bunny number forty. Hey, I'm Bunny number forty, and guess what, people? I'm for sale, along with my little booklet. Please watch the video and then purchase me. Woohoo! Okay, um, thank you, Bunny. This has a handmade heart with some pin with some beads on it and a little um charm with three little pink roses and some seam binding. And this is the journal and it's closed with I don't know what's that called organza I'm not really sure uh, some kind of a ribbony thing and uh, that's a technical term so a lot of people don't know that but yes it is ribbony thing and here is a little um, pin tied to it that has a pretty little puffy heart with a couple of um, pretty pearls on it. And this one is a um, piece of embroidery like um, it was on a oh, like a what do you call those things? <laughs> you know when they put down a scarf on a desk or a table or a dresser or something and it had um, really purple really pretty purple embroidery flowers and stuff. And I put lace around the edges, and then the bottom was already, like, uh, scalloped. This is the spine. This is the back. Has uh, some really cool napkin decoupage. Okay, and inside we have a big crocheted, like, thing... <laughs> And I sewed it on the first and the last page to make a pocket. And so this has um this has some layers of old book pages. Here is a little tag and in the tag it says, I am your forever friend. I will always be by your side and oh my goodness. Here is Bunny, all dressed up in his fancy clothes, ready for an outing. He's got lace and doily. He's got a tuxedo on. Woohoo! He looks so handsome. And this is the outside of the tag, which I just folded up to make like a little booklet. And here are two lover bunnies, or bunny lovers, or I'm not sure how you say that. Two people... I mean, <laughs> two rabbits that are in love. There you go. And they're kissing. So, behind that, there is this little thing. And it says, When I saw you, I fell in love, and you smiled because you knew. And that's by Shakespeare. And this is an old poem by Lord Byron. And I just folded it up to put in there, and then the back, look at this, people, can you believe it? This is, um, for journaling purposes. There is a whole bunch. I put some, uh, pattern paper on that, and this is just for journaling purposes, and the other side has a romantic, um, Lord Byron poem. And then we have this guy, um, on here, and it comes with this little thing. It says, In the tragic case of Mr. Dumpty and his fall off the wall, the presiding judge ruled an accidental death and not a homicide, and all the king's men were thankfully cleared of any wrongdoing in their attempt to put Mr. Dumpty together again. So, that was a relief, because, you know, they were only trying to be helpful, and when Mr. Dumpty couldn't go back together again, they were afraid that maybe, you know, they could be charged with some crime, but it's all good. They're going to be just fine. That's the, That was the judge in the case. And here we have 
Um, this is a metal embellishment. I got a brad at the top and a brad at the bottom, and then it's left open, so you can use it like a tuck spot. And this is your certificate of authenticity, which every bunny comes with in a handmade envelope. So that goes in there. Then we have this lovely bunny. She's got a beautiful blue brooch on. And this is rather Victorian-y, I guess. To become a real bunny, you must prove yourself brave, truthful, and unselfish. That is Pinocchio. I like this paper. And here is a paper, or a page that's got lavender on it. I love lavender. And this is, it says Earl Grey Tea. It's a little ticket or tag or whatever. And in here is a little tiny envelope. And it, listen to that delightful crunch. Isn't that cool? And uh, this is a little, little tiny book that I made out of a tea bag. And I just... It says, come along, let's have tea and biscuits and see if we can make this world a better place. And here's a stamp of bunny. And here is... It says, a cup of tea is always a good idea. And you can see through the pages, so I only stamped on one side. And this has a couple stamps on it. It says, find a cup. The teapot is behind you. Now tell me about hundreds of things. And then this has a little stamp that says, friends. This has a little stamp that's got a couple of leaves on it. And that's the end. And then it's got the little tag that came with it. It says, one thorn of experience is worth a whole wilderness of warning. Ooh, that's pretty deep. <laughs> okay. Anyway, so that goes back in here. Just a little, I don't know. I just felt like making a little book, so I did. And, uh, yeah. And then I made, I used the, the baking paper to make the little envelope. Ooh, crunch, crunch. And that goes right in here where it says Earl Grey Tea. Here, again, is the bunny maid with her carrot cake. And it says, once you become real, you can't become unreal again. It lasts for always. The Velveteen Rabbit. And this is also um, Lord Byron Correspondence. This is a picture of a lovely bunny lady. It says, Adventures with Bunny. And, oh my goodness, there he is, flying a kite with a heart. And uh, this is just, you know, the book to write down all your adventures with Bunny. It's never too late to dream another dream. And then there's a friend stamp. And that goes right here in this pocket. And then over here is the back part of that... Um, crochet stuff, and it says, I promise, this is Bunny's promise, I will, wait a minute, I will not chew with my mouth open, unless, of course, I just had some sort of oral surgery, I will not sniff my armpits at the table to see if I need a shower, I do so solemnly swear, Bunny, so, there you go, that's Bunny's promise that He's going to be a good roommate, and that's the back of the book. So, um, if you are interested in bunny number 40, I'm 40, I'm bunny number 40, um, then you can check out my Etsy store, and he will be available. Thank you so much. Bye, guys.